For this recipe you will need 1 pound chicken 1 tablespoon fresh ginger 1 tablespoon minced garlic 1 quarter cup soy sauce 1 quarter cup pineapple juice 1 tablespoon honey 1 and a half tablespoons rice vinegar 1 tablespoon cornstarch green onions and sesame seeds So to start out you're going to go ahead and just take your chicken breast and just start cooking that in a pan You can definitely use oil if you like, but I just like to cook with water the majority of the time. And now this is a personal preference. You can either cut up your chicken before you cook it, or you can cut it up after you're completely done cooking it. But what I've found works best for me is to actually go ahead and cook the outside of it a little bit and then go ahead and cut it up. It just seems easier to cut and then it cooks way faster that way. But however you wanna do it is perfectly fine. And then if you've decided to go ahead and cut it up early like I am, go ahead and return that back to the pan. And as your chicken is finishing up cooking, go ahead and start making your sauce. So first you're going to go ahead and peel your ginger. And a really great tip I've found is to freeze your ginger because it will make it last longer and it makes it really easy to peel and mince. And then I just use the back of a spoon to go ahead and take the peel off. And then mince it and add it into the bowl. Next, add in your minced garlic, followed by your soy sauce, and pineapple juice, and honey. Your rice vinegar. And then once you have all those ingredients in your bowl, go ahead and just give that a really good stir and make sure everything is completely combined. And then just set that aside. And in another small bowl, go ahead and make a mixture of one tablespoon cornstarch and one tablespoon water. And then just go ahead and mix that really well and set that aside as well. And once you have all of your sauces mixed together, you will just go back to your chicken and it should be mostly done cooking by now. So if it's not quite done cooking, I will still just add the sauce into it and just let it finish up cooking. And if it is done cooking, then I will just add the sauce in and let it cook for about two more minutes. And be sure to stir it up really well so that all of the sauce will really coat all of your chicken. And then once your chicken's been cooking in the sauce for a few minutes, go ahead and add in your cornstarch mixture and give it a good stir and you will see it almost immediately thicken up your sauce and all of that good sauce will start sticking to your chicken. It is looking so good, you guys. So then I just like to let that cook for about one more minute before plating it. And then you can just add on any additional toppings and serve it however you like. I love adding green onions and sesame seeds and we usually serve it with rice and veggies, but you can definitely serve it on a lettuce wrap. Any way you eat this, it is going to be delicious. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Do not forget to subscribe down below if you are not already. And also follow me over on Instagram, and I will see you in my next one.